On this episode, we're drawing a pirate gorilla. Welcome to Imagination Art Station, and on today's episode, we're drawing a pirate gorilla. We're gonna start with an eye patch, because all great pirates have an eye patch, unless your name is Captain Jack. We'll give him another eye and add the pupil. That's the black part of the eye. Our pirate gorilla won't be wearing a hat. Instead, we're giving this guy a bandana. Gorillas have long heads, and I wanna show his fur sticking out of the top of the bandana. That looks good. He's gonna have a big smile because being a pirate is awesome. We'll add his nose and give him an ear. Start a knot in the bandana and continue with his furry chin. Let's bring his jaw down to his chin. His bandana is tied in a knot, so we need to add loose ends. Next, we're gonna start his sword strap and bring it down across his body. We'll also start his chest muscles. This guy has a lot of upper body strength. His shoulders will be raised up and his hands will rest on his hips. This guy is proud to be a pirate. Gorillas have big strong arms and hands. This helps them climb if they need to. Okay, we'll finish up his arms and chest. Bring his body down and add a belt and buckle. Gorilla's legs are smaller than their arms, so we'll give this guy little legs. Because he's a pirate, his pants will be torn and ratty. Let's give him feet. Gorilla's feet kind of look like hands, so we'll stick a toe out like a thumb. This is looking good. Time to give him his pirate sword. He'll carry it right here on his side. For shading, I'll make the lines thicker in the darker areas, then add some cross hatching. Adding shading really helps bring him to life. Let's put some wrinkles in his bandana and round out his belly. And to finish off his pirate look, we're adding an earring. He definitely looks like a pirate now. We'll add a little more shading to show off his muscles. It's time for some color. His bandana will be red. As I'm coloring, I'm pushing harder on the crown on the shaded areas. This helps give dimension to the drawing. His earring will be gold, so we'll color that yellow. I'll make his sword strap and belt brown. They're made out of leather, so brown is a good color. We'll make his belt buckle gold too. His pants will be brown with black stripes. Remember, pushing a little harder in the shaded areas gives a nice look. His sword is made of steel, so we'll color that gray. Time for his fur. I'm going to start with blue and lightly color around his body. I'll add a layer of black on top of the blue. This helps give a richness to his fur and really adds to his character. Again, I'll color a little darker in the shaded areas. And to give him a bit more character, I'll add light blue to his highlights.
We'll add white to his eye and darken up the eye patch. Touch up the last few details and done. Check out our pirate gorilla. Next episode, this guy will have his very own adventure. If you like this episode, consider subscribing. And until next time, have fun and be creative.